Hey, this is Black Rose, and this is going to be my RuneScape 3 beta walk around video. Um, HTML5, which is, which is RS3. Uh, some of you, for for those who haven't actually got accepted into the beta, this video is just to show you what it's actually like before you actually get accepted or get to play it. Um, this is even my first walk around. Uh, in the beginning of the behind the scenes question and answers for RS3, they said that you should take a walk around and help them gather data of different areas and places and such. So I'm going to just walk around the map, um, look at the different views, the different graphic changes. Um, I logged in for five minutes earlier just to see what it's actually like. And the first thing I noticed was the graphic options. There's not a lot of them. Uh, the reason why is because I think they're very limited on what they have in HTML5. Um, there's some features like the world map and quick chat and everything that doesn't work. There's a lot of glitches right now because it's just the release of beta. Um, so that's expected. So if you guys think, oh, RuneScape 3 is a piece of shit, blah, 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 actually wait until it release because they have so much to work on and it's just a work in progress. So let's play some HTML5 beta. Um, the first load screen was actually took a while, but uh, hopefully it will be faster now that I actually played it one time, but it doesn't look like it will be. Um, oh wow, that was glitchy. Uh, you guys can't see it because my recording screen isn't actually that high up there. But uh, it says preloading shaders, so before you even log in, it preloads some of the different graphic options and such. Um, I'm going to block out my login details because I think that's what I should do to keep my account safe. Now, uh, first thing I also noticed when logging in, RuneScape 3 Beta has all the same servers, which they said they would. They, they, everything that you did in Beta will count for the main game. What I didn't expect was to share all the same servers with people that play RS2 and Beta. So, other players don't know if you're on Beta. Um, of course, yeah, so you can't tell if somebody's on RS2 or RS Beta. So, but you can tell if you're playing it in the top right corner, it'll say RuneScape 3 Beta, which I'll show you in a second. I'm just going to choose a random world here because it doesn't save my worlds. Um, let's log in. As you can tell, it's glitchy, staticky looking. Uh, right here it says HTML5 Beta. And yes, it lags and loading for a second, but it's it all shows up eventually <laughs> let's uh... oof my sounds are on um... yeah i'm gonna turn that off although they probably have new sounds and such which is really cool for runescape but uh... i rather wait until they perfect all the sounds and music and monster sounds um... before i actually start playing the sound because i never do uh, it is glitchy looking when you walk. Um, it, at least it does for me. I'm not sure about you guys. My bloom effect is on. Um, I tried turning it off in the options. It didn't help. So, oh, and the view rotation is actually a lot slower for some reason. I think that's just a little glitchy right now. But pretty much this is what's around me. As you can see, I'm obviously in Falador or north of Falador. So you can see all in the background. Let's teleport to Varrock first. I'm going to oof. Oof. Can you imagine? Can you imagine playing in a world that's glitchy like that? Alright. Oh. This view rotation's killing me. It's too slow. Alright. Um. Okay. Varok Center. Varok Center. Varok Center. Alright. Here's Varok Center. Um. The grass actually looks a bit different, trees actually look different, everything actually looks different, even my RuneScape character, which is weird. He looks super fucking white. Why, why is my guy super white? Why is everybody super white? That's racist. Alright, let's get started. I'm going to run because this video would probably take forever if I walked, of course. Um, that's a pretty cool looking avatar. Graphics are different. All right, right away you can tell that you can see super far, which is awesome, um, in my opinion. You can't actually see. I mean, you see a trees, forest. You can tell how far the world actually goes. Like it's 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 a real world now. Actually, that's what it makes me feel like. It's it's actually way better than being claustrophobic inside some bubble of smoke. Um, already, right away, you can see Falador from the bridge to Barbarian Village. There's Falador Wall. 
Uh, the water, I noticed, is much different. However, I don't like the look of it. Hopefully they have changes for the water, because that water doesn't look... It looks realistic in a way, but it's not... It's not what I like. Um, is that fishing spot green? Uh, that's probably a glitch. I'm assuming, yeah, fishing spots are green. That's a glitch, most likely. Let's get on with the journey, huh? I'm going to stop at Ice Wolf, no, Ice Mountain, I think it's called. Not White Wolf, Ice Mountain, um, just to get a look around the map. Uh, last time I tried that, I actually crashed. So if this video does crash, I'm uh, really sorry. Like I said, it's it's beta testing. Oops, didn't mean to do that. What the hell, where did I get Strawberry Basket from? I'm going to have to look through the video and see where I just picked up these basket of strawberries. That's weird, I'm keeping them though. My shit. Alright, you can see Taverly off in the distance way over here. Um, there's the monastery. God, the world looks way more dynamic. It's not like... I don't even know how to s explain it. It just looks way better, in my opinion. It's glitchy, but when they fix all the glitches, this will be amazing. I'm never playing in Java ever again, HTML5 all the way. I had to actually download Chrome just to play the beta, um, which I didn't want to do. But whatever, I downloaded Chrome, and um, yeah, so this is Ice Wolf Mountain, as you can see right away. Wow. All right, well, I noticed that, uh, well, right there, the altar is glowing, which is kind of interesting. Not sure how well you guys can see that, but there's beams of light coming from the altar. That's how you know there's an altar there. Um, you see Taverly, all of Taverly, which is actually pretty epic. Uh Falador, of course, that's a great ass view. Um, the monastery, Edgeville, there's Edgeville. Although it's not on fire, which is weird because I did Ritual de Majorat or whatever, and that place should be on fire. That is. Oh, Barbarian Village, okay, oh, of course, duh. So, yes, um, right away, you could tell all the different views. It actually looks. Well, it looks better, in my opinion. Um, foresty ish right here which is good I mean it is kinda like forest although they should add more trees probably make them closer together let's get off this mountain and let's continue on with the run um, ice fiends or not ice, yeah ice fiends uh, they look shiny why does everything look shinier and white um, bloom never did that before in the last game so it's, it's kind of a different effect I guess I love the grass though. The grass, oh my god. The flooring, the everything is much better. It's just not one solid color of brown and green anymore. It's it's mixed light green, dark green, different kinds of shades of browns. Um the trees look better. It's I think it looks like a bloom effect on the trees for some reason. This is the first glitch I noticed earlier, by the way. Um the musician is indeed floating uh the power of music, I guess, eh? Eh? Anybody? Eh? No. No, but really, um... Yeah, this is a problem. I already reported it using the new bug report for HTML5. Report a bug. Um, so if any of you guys are playing beta, you guys find a glitch, please report it. Uh, I would love for all the glitches to be fixed before we actually start playing. And you may have noticed that um, I'm not wearing my armor. Uh, the reason why is because even Jagex said, take it slow. Uh, you might be crashing, you might be seeing all these things, there might be glitches. So I don't want to risk dying and losing my shit over, well, over a bug. So you just have to be careful. Um, they also said, take it easy. Don't start off with the highest graphic setting, which I did. Uh, immediately I started off. I think I'm in the highest graphic setting. Let me make sure. Hi, confirm. Yeah, I am. So, but... I'm risky, and my computer is a pretty good computer. It's it's um, 16 gigabytes of RAM and really nice i7 Intel processor and all that shit. So it's worth the money. Uh, oof! What is that? What's that island? I'm trying to remember what that could be. What that could possibly be? What the fuck is that island? Oh wow, okay, that's interesting. That's actually really cool. You could see Catherby from this dock. Oh my god, that's amazing. That's really cool. Uh, 
that's that house. I'm pretty sure that's that house for that one quest along the shore. Wow, that's really nice. What is this? What is this? I'm so lost now. Is this in Trana? I could look at... No, I can't look at the map. The map's glitched on beta. I believe this is in Trana. Maybe. No. Can't be in Trana. What the fuck? Where am I? Yeah, that's in Train. I don't know what that is. Whatever. Anyways, let's move on. The water effect still looks... Uh, it's, it's okay. It's a nice water effect, I guess. Better than what it was. Can't complain. Oops, don't chop a tree. Alright, let's continue on with the HTML5. Aww. Aww. What the fuck? Sorry, sir, but you're getting reported for botting on fucking wolves. If you're a bot, let's see if this guy's a bot. Hello? Oh, okay, well, obviously you're not a bot. You just decided to kill a wolf. You fucking wolf killer. Sick motherfucker. Type of sick joke. Type of sick hobbies are you into? Jesus Christ, where's the pathway? Wait, is it... I'm on the wrong path. Yeah, there we go. On the road again! Ha 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 ha! Road again! I don't, I don't know the lyrics. I, I really don't. I'm sorry. Uh, alright. What is this place? Oh, okay. Warrior's Guild. Um, Birthrup is down there. Wow. Wow. That's... Ugh, still can't get over that. The long distance view. That's awesome. <laughs> um, nerdgasm. Yes. I really don't care if you guys really don't care, but I care, so... Fuck you guys. I don't care about your opinion. I love it. Uh, wow. All the views. I don't feel locked up in a box anymore. This is awesome. 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 Cather B. Uh, whoa, okay. I thought that guy wasn't going to show up. Okay, yes, um, fishing spots are, uh, glitched green, uh, sewage bubbles, so I suggest you do not fish in the green sewage, um, whoa, what the hell? Oh, okay. Do not fish in the green sewage, uh, you might, well, that's just gross, actually. I don't think I'm going to be fishing at all in HTML5 until I fix the fishing spots. I, I'm not fishing in green water, that's... It's just fucking wrong. What do you think? I, I'm rich. I don't need this shit. I'm not a third world country. I don't need to do this shit. Do I look like a fucking goblin to you? I'm not doing this shit. No. I get my shit fresh. So, I'm rich. I don't deserve this. Alright. Let's move on. A forest is obviously ahead because I cannot see a damn thing behind these trees. So, wow. Yeah. Foresty. Never realized actually how foresty it was until, uh... Oh my god. This is foresty. <laughs> Hope I don't get mugged on the way in there. Run into a witch. Eat my golden apple. <laughs> you can eat my apples any day, babe. Let's see here. Alright, we're obviously in Sears Village. This video's probably already been about 10 minutes, probably longer. I might stop it soon, make a video too. Um, I'm really not sure though. Maybe I'll just make it one long video, and if you guys really want to keep watching, then keep watching. Uh, wow, all those red maple trees, that's pretty cool, actually. I love red. Red's my favorite color. Wow. That's really cool. Um, I'm not gonna go this way, though. I'm gonna cut back. Oh, no, I'll just go around this way and then cut back. Because I really don't care about Relica. Actually, no, I do care about Relica. I want to see if you can see Moon Clan islands and shit, how far out to the sea you could actually see, so... Oh, uh, there's an island over there, which I never knew. What island is that? Is that even an island? What is that place? I don't even know. I don't even fucking know, bro. <sighs> See? You could be almost maxed and be so confused of where you are. Because all these new pieces of land that you've never seen... I didn't even know that place was this close to this area of the map. I didn't even know that. I didn't know a lot of things were this close to different islands. Um, it actually... It doesn't show you how small the map is. It actually feels a lot bigger. Even though it does show you how close islands are to each other and such. Um, 
overall it still looks amazing. It makes the world feel a lot bigger. You're not you're not in a box anymore just running around and no, it's actually quite nice. One thing I didn't like though or don't like is uh player rendering is still the same as it appears like the NPCs and such. Um I've always had that problem. I hated that. I wish I could see somebody really far away from me. That will probably make PKing interesting. Be like, oh, there's a person running way over there. Let's go hunt him down. I used to do that shit all the time in other MMOs. Um, once again, with the green sewage shit fucking bubbles. That's gross. Okay, right away, I can see an island. Is that a fucking island? Yeah, that's... Wow, that's a little glitchy looking. Can anybody explain to me what that is? Uh... I think that's the back of a monster or something. There's the spikes and the... Oh, shit, I'm fishing. What the hell? Sorry, drop that. Drop that. Okay. Um, well, I'm going to travel anyways. Whoa. Glitched. Wow, look at the mini-map. Whoa. I'm fucking swimming. Unless it never showed the dock. Probably not. I don't know. I can't remember. An island that might be Piscator's fishing colony. Maybe. I don't know what that is, actually. Oh, wow. You can see how close the islands are to each other. Huh. Wow, glitch. Lag and glitch. Walk, please. Okay. Well, you can obviously see how close the islands are to each other. Um, I was going to see where Moonclan Isle is and shit, but... I don't feel like running all the way over there. Whoa. Alright, let's just say that we ran all the way to Erdun, Ardoin. It's actually pronounced Ardoin. Says Jagex, Ardoin. Um, I'm not saying that, though. I'm going to say Erdun, just because it sounds cooler than Ardoin. Meet me at Ardoin. It's not happening. It's just not. It's not going to happen. Rendering, rendering, rendering. Okay, no fences here anymore. That's cool. Open field of fucking farming patch. That's awesome. <laughs> All right. Um, let's run through Erdun or Ardoin. Ugh, Ardoin. Um, can't see anything different just because the giant building is right here. Okay, so Ardoin is actually quite cluster or compact, close together with giant buildings. So. It's not like you could actually really see anything or how far the terrain goes, although you can see it in the background right here. Um, oh, shit. Run. Okay. Wow, Karamja, if that's how you pronounce it. But I'm going to pronounce it that way because I've always pronounced it like that since I was a nub. Karamja is right there. Honestly, <laughs> why did I take that ship? During that one quest with the troll, my uh, my arm's big adventure. Why did I take that ship up this river? Like I could have swam. Hell, I could have got on top of my arm's shoulders and just walked to shore over there. Like if you pay a ship to go to Karamja from here, you got ripped. I actually, just started noticing that. Wow, that's fucked up. They owe me so much money from traveling using ships because I could have swam my punk ass to this island. That's bullshit. Alright, whatever. It's alright, I forgive Jagex. They fucked up. It's okay. It's alright, they fucked up. As long as they know that they fucked up. They fucked up, guys. They did. They fucked up. What the hell is this boat for? Hell, I can just steal that boat next time. I'm stealing that boat to get to Karamja. Somebody just leaves a boat there, not even on a dock, it's just sitting there. Rowboat. I don't care. I get strength experience rowboating. Alright. Here's the workout guy, working out, doing his push-ups or whatever he was doing. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm sorry about that view, people. Uh, I'm stuck on trees. Oh, shit, don't cut, don't cut, don't cut. Oh, Jesus, I look like a bot. <laughs> I look like a fucked up bot. Alright. Um, can't see that much. I wonder if I click way over there. Holy shit. If you click super far away, your character will run over there. That's a plus. Okay, so. One thing we noticed. If you click super fucking far away, your character will run super fucking far away. Huh. 
That's actually quite cool. Less minimap clicking and uh, more. I want to be way at Falador. Click on Falador and run from Lumbridge. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right. Wow. Okay, cool. Oh, glitchy, glitchy, glitchy. Okay, see? This is what I mean. This is exactly what I mean. I could have just... Wow. I could have just jumped off this dock, swam three feet. No, not three feet. But, like, how far would you say that guy is? That would probably be... That's not a long swim at all. I could jump in this shit and swim right over there. It's really not that hard. That pisses me off. Instead, I have to go all the way around and take a ship. Or a Glory Ami teleport, which is still a rip-off, because you can just jump your punk ass. Man, my RuneScape adventure is 99 agility, okay? I could just probably run from the entrance or the starting of this dock and jump and leap on that island. That's how fucking strong my RuneScape character is. Yeah, he's boss. He's pretty fucking awesome. I've seen him do some amazing agility courses. You're telling me he can't jump six feet or more. So, come on. My RuneScape... Plus, he has wings. Just... Put on a fucking corrupt aura, something. Fly his punk ass over there. What I'm saying is that's really sad how close the islands are, and you have to take a charter ship to get there. That's fucked up. Um, summoning, mining. Am I already this close next to Yana? No way. Holy shit. Okay, that was a short run than normal to me. At least it felt like it. I'm already at Yana I didn't even realize. Wow, that's... That's gay. Alright, um... Ooglog is that direction. So, let's test my theory. If you click super far away, will your character run there? I'm going to click right here and just let go of the mouse. I'll just put it in the center of the screen and... We'll see. Run there. No? Okay. Run there. No. Okay. Run there. Alright, well, my RuneScape character is lazy and doesn't feel like running. Maybe maybe it was only for that one location or something. Here, what about if I click on the tree? No, it doesn't register. Wait, is that an island? That could be an island. No, that's fucking Ooglog. Then what the hell? Jackax ripped me off. Oh, there we go. Okay, so if I click right over here, then he runs. So it's decently far... It's outside the minimap region of clicking, which is cool. Whoa, that guy was fucking ice skating. Please ice skate again, Mr. Ogre. Oh damn, he's not doing it anymore. Oh yeah. Oh dude. That's they need to update the ogre's looks more. I wanna see those titties bounce. Alright, let's keep running. Ogre, ogre, ogre. Okay, this looks really weird. Um, wow, it's the it's the forest of never-ending return. There's Uglog, right there. I can see it from here. So you fucking noobs should never get lost ever again. Actually, um, you could almost see every village from every other town. Uh, just run a bit and look at it. All you have to learn is colors. Gray, most likely it's fucking Varrock. White, Falador. Lumbridge, well, you'll be there because you're a noob. Um, palm trees. What the fuck is up with all those trees? Looks like looks like some big booty bitches leaned against them or something. The hell? Palm, not all palm trees are fucking crooked like that, Jagex. You guys need to fucking recognize. Wow. I could go outside and see a palm tree right now, and they don't do that shit. Some of them do, but not all of them. That's unnatural. That looks like a storm was here for like nine years. The fuck, Jagex? Now you're just showing me how badly graphic you guys actually made the game in the past. Oop, oop. Sorry, Spirit Ippling. I'm cheap. I need charms. Eh. Did I get a charm? No. What the fuck did you give me? Steel plate bodies? That's 2k and I'm cheap. I will keep that. <laughs> I think that's 2k. Is that 2k, RuneScape? Is that 2k, YouTube? I'm pretty sure that's 2k. Alright, um, the beach, I'm not gonna run all the way to Ooglog, that place sucks, it smells like fucking ogre ass, and my ex-girlfriend, so it's just, ugh. Sophie knows what that smells like, she's into porn and shit, so, you guys know Sophie, she's in like all my videos. 
All right. Uh, well, that's that. Let's teleport somewhere else. Let's think of somewhere to teleport to. Lunar Isle. Let's go to Lunar Isle. Whoa, my teleport is glitched. It's all right. It's cool, though. I love floating fucking things. I don't even know what the hell that's called. I can't remember the word for it. Whoa! All right, floating roofs. Oh, damn. All right. Dun 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 dun. Why do you see the ship from here? Wow, the background actually looks quite glitchy. Jagex, bug report, bug report. Um, that's cool though. You can see the ship from here. I think you could originally see the ship anyway. So maybe I'm just being stupid, but. Um, well, sorry about that. All you saw was inside that house. And now I'm inside a mountain. Alright. Completionist. Douchebag. Wish I had your cape. Alright. Uh, still working on Maxed. <laughs> um, what is this place? Is that the first ship? That's the same ship. Don't play me. That's the same ship right there. Just over there. Because you're supposed to take the ship to there and then take the ship to here. Glitch. You should turn that ship invisible when you're on this island somehow. Work on a Jagex. Fucking fails. Alright, uh, let's see what else. Well, you we can't really see anything else. I don't even know what island that is over there. I'm guessing it's a magical island full of mischief and wonder. <clears throat> Alright, well... This altar doesn't have a glow either. What the fuck? Alright. Uh, let's go to the bandit camp. I never went to the desert yet. Hope I don't die. I really don't care if I die. No! I'm gonna lose my strawberries. I don't want to die. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to open up Skype. Fuck, I always do that in the video. I accidentally open Skype without thinking. I see the orange, so I open that shit. Wow, this is the desert? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck? Okay, so those are just random... Okay, so far I hate the desert. Um, this is shitty, Jagex. What the fuck? I'm gonna check my options. Why is the sand like that? Why? I was expecting the sand to have a lot more oomph to it. This is original RuneScape shit. This is bad. I fucking vote no to the desert. Alright. You guys better start fixing this shit. I'm not even kidding, Jagex. If you're watching this video, you assholes. No, I'm just kidding. You're not assholes. I don't know. You guys can't judge you guys. But seriously, please fix the desert. This place doesn't look good at all. I live in the desert. I still live in the desert. Uh, I've lived in the desert for 14 years. And by the way, um, deserts aren't always like this. Just to let you know. I mean, when you think of a desert, yeah, you think of something kind of like this. But this is over-exaggerated of desert. You're thinking of, like, Gobi Desert or Egyptian Sands Desert. This isn't realistic. Uh, anyways, like I was saying, um, on with the graphics. This sand on the floor, I hate it. It's just one color brown. It's shitty. And that one picture looking at, uh, what was that, Shanti's Pass? Or Shantae? Shaniqua's Pass? Shaniqua? Looking at Shantae's Pass? Uh, the ground was a lot more bright, like this color sand. I don't know if it's my options. Let's go through my options and see here. Confirm. High detail. What about... Okay, that looks like shit. No mid... And low detail. That's... Whoa, my view turns a lot faster now. Change it back to high detail. Watch the world just sinking around you. Alright. Shadows, dynamic, bloom... What if I turn Bloom off? Okay, alright. Not much of a difference, but okay, it's a little lighter. Okay, that's interesting. I'm going to leave it on, though, because Bloom effects are pretty nice. Anti-aliasing. That did nothing. Oh, yes, it did. It made it brighter. Whoa, what did I do? Okay. Click through chat boxes on water detail. That's high. Let's see what low is. Oh, shit, I'm taking damage. 
Okay, well, that's pretty cool, though. You can still see in the distance. You can see um, Sofanam, I think the name of the place is. I don't know how to pronounce it. Actually, I don't even remember if that's the name of the place. Uh, but, yeah, you can see Polvnevich, Polvnevich, the ancient temple. You see the Calphite Lair right there, or Calphite King Lair right there. Um, okay, well, let's see what the water looks like on low detail. Uh, water detail. Low. Ew. Okay. Alright. I... Alright. Obviously, there's a plague in the water. Look at all the brown and greenish look to it. There's a plague. Um, don't drink the water. This is Mexico's water. Do not drink the Mexico's water. That's horrible. Okay, I'm changing that back. Make it all shiny again. Whoa. Draw distance. Hi. Um, by the way, this is the beginning of beta. This is the very first day release. So yes, there's a lot of glitches. There's a lot of uh a lot of glitches. Most likely the sand here is a glitch. Um there's a lot of glitches. So they will fix them. They're not gonna release RS three. Well, I'm not gonna call it RS three, I'm just gonna call it fucking uh well I have to call it RS three. They're not gonna release RS three glitched. So, I mean, they may have a little small glitches upon release, but not like this. This is really glitchy. I've come across a lot of glitches so far. Um, as you can see, you can see all the way the fuck over there, which is actually pretty cool. No more getting lost in the desert, eh? No, I have to look at the world map anymore. Alright, well, let's go back to Varrock and uh, meet up with our favorite niggers. I mean, oh, that was racist. I try not to be racist in videos. Uh, I might bleep that out, depending on how lazy I am. If you're black, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm black too, so... I'm not black, I'm sorry. Actually, goddamn, I'm putting myself in. Technically, I'm black, because I am Black Rose. So we... We're both brothers from another mother, you know what I mean? But, um, sorry if I offended you by saying nigger. Nigger. Alright. Felina. Puff of Green. Wow, that's a nice name. Anyways, uh, as you can see in Varrock Center, you can see the walls, well, the walls all the way around, which is cool. Somebody's burning fires over there, so. Why am I so fucking albino? I don't like that. Hmm. Okay. <sighs> I'm tired. Oh, I noticed one more thing. Let me, uh, I'm gonna bleep out my bank pin. But, uh, let's go to my bank. Uh, bleeping out right now. Alright. Or if it's not already, but... Oops, did I... Just to be sure, I just didn't enter the wrong number, because I think I did. Exchange. Alright, there we go. My bank. Um, oh shit. Alright, well first you may notice, this isn't my bank, this is a grand exchange. I sold my bondos. Oh, a pair of my bondos, I still have another set. Um... Fury, all the items have like a black glow around it. That's one glitch. Even my teleport tabs, the, my basket of strawberries, and the note. Uh, I'm not going to collect that money yet. Um, so yeah, all the items have like a black glow to it. In my opinion, the party hat looks actually kind of cool like that. Uh, so the dry gores, they look evil. Ew! Dude, is that my Tokar cow? The hell happened to my Tokar cow? That's, um, that's gross looking, actually. I wouldn't wear that. Let's see what that looks like. Whoa, okay, like a white flame to it. Tokar cow is a little glitchy. As you can see, obviously. Duh. It looks like a dark world, too. I can't wait until they bring more graphic options out, because I hate the dark look to it. I, I'm always on brightest settings. Uh, dark, 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 my bondos, Torva, dark, 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 it's all dark backgrounds, which is pretty cool. Ew! Okay, skill capes look like shit. Um, where's my hunter skill cape? Hunter skill cape, that literally looks like, well, uh, looks about the same, actually. <laughs> Sadly, ew, okay, it looks like somebody just took my HP cape and rubbed it through mud. That's cool. Wow. That's not white. That's not white at all. Wait, why am I super not albino anymore? Whoa, the shading effect. Okay. The 
The shading effect. Holy shit, I just realized that. <laughs> wow. Okay. So it's affected. These are actually affected. So the sun is obviously facing that way. Um, that's really cool. I'm not sure if regular RuneScape does that or not. I don't remember it actually doing that. So shadows actually affect the light on you. That is interesting. Okay. They need to work on the graph the the shading of the shadows first, but overall that looks really cool. And oh my god, my HP cape looks godly. Oh. All right. Uh take that shit off. Looks like somebody dragged it through mud though in the picture. <laughs> Shitty mud caves. Uh, mud shitty. All my caves look super muddy. My muddy skill caves brings all the girls to the yard. Damn right. My dick is better than yours. Whoa. Samid's gloves are fucked up to the max. Type of glow. Okay, so they're still kind of goldish. Not really. It just looks like I have a yellow trim around my albino hands. Put those back. Um. What else? Whoa. Whoa! Okay, hold on. My onyx. That actually looks really cool to me. Uh, dark emo gem of death. That's what. That's the new name of that. Ew. The hell? Diamond? That's gross. Looks like somebody just gave me a muddy-ass diamond. Or, those look muddy and dark, but I mean, then again, it is ore, so it should be dirty. Like a... Like a... Like a Sophia. No, I'm just kidding. Uh... Phew garbage and nothing different just darkness nothing interesting and nothing interesting just darkness whoa what the hell potions potions look different only because the glow around them though that's interesting super fires huh okay um I really don't know what else to show you guys. That was pretty much just my walk around just to show you guys some basic shit of course like I said they're going to be fixing a lot of it um, so, yeah, I'm going to do a before-after video after this one. Um, I'm going to release it later on in beta, so you guys could actually see the changes, um, not when they're glitched. I don't want to show you guys RuneScape when it's glitched, so, other than this video. Um, other than that, this is my video of RuneScape 3 beta. Uh, it is actually pretty cool, even though it's glitchy right now. It is cool. They're going to be adding a lot more options. Uh, like I said, they said the world map's not fixed, as you can see. Obviously. Wow. It's all black. Um, and all that shit, so. <sighs> Look at all those fucking noobs. Seriously, they're all noobs. I see that guy here all the fucking time, too, actually, in World 87. I see that guy with the green party hat, thinking he's so cool because he has a party hat. You're still welfare because you spent your whole bank on a party hat. You know that, right? It's your shit fucking total level. Anyways, um, not judging. <laughs> yeah, I am. I'm fucking judging. All right. Uh, yeah, so this is it. So rate, comment, subscribe. Um, please follow me. Uh, subscribe and follow my videos. I will be making a lot more R3 videos showing you glitches and all that cool, exciting, fun shit. Um, I actually already found a glitch that... Uh, makes objects fly in the air, kind of like that musician, so I'll release that very soon. Um, other than that, have a great day. Take care. Uh, and if you haven't been released into RS3, I'm sure they'll release you soon. Everybody will get to play RS3 beta before they actually release it to the game. Um, you're not missing out. It's glitched right now, so most likely a lot of you probably won't even be playing the beta right now, just because of how glitched it is. Uh, Remember, if you do start playing the beta, Jagex said start off slow, take it easy, do some beginning skills. Not beginning, but just do some basic skilling, woodcutting, fishing, fire making. Uh, don't go any combat, don't go God Wars dungeon, don't do anything extreme, because there's a high risk that the server could shut off, you could crash, and you will die. So just stay safe, and um, enjoy RuneScape 3, because honestly, this looks like a really good future is coming to RuneScape. And I give Jagex some mad props. 2007 scape is still pretty cool. Um, that's still thriving. A lot of people still play that. Like 40,000 people still play that uh, every day that's on whenever I look. That's good. Um, just keep playing RuneScape, guys. I mean, it's a fun game. Uh, just remember, the game does not come first. Life comes first. So, I'm not saying that you're no life. I'm just saying if your friends ask you to go outside, I mean, go outside.
<laughs> anyways um take care guys and uh have a good day